Stop memorizing hundreds of lead code problems and instead focus on the patterns to help you ace any interview. Today we're looking at everyone's favorite, dynamic programming. Use DP when you have overlapping subproblems and optimal substructure. When you have optimization problems, such as finding the minimum and maximum of something. When you have sequence problems, when you have combinatorial counts, such as number of ways, and finally, when you want to reduce the exponential complexity to polynomial time. Let's take a look at the Fibonacci example. If I want to solve Fibonacci of 4, I have to recursively solve Fibonacci 3, 2, and 1, and for each of those, recursively solve their subproblems as well. What happens here is that we repeat a lot of the calculations that we already solved in the past on the left-hand side. This results in an O of 2 to the N algorithm with O of N space. Can we do better? We can use the top-down approach with memoization. Memoization is just a fancy term for a simple hash map that stores and caches previous results. So in this case, we're going to cache all the intermediate results, and you'll notice that we do not even have to recalculate Fibonacci of 1 and Fibonacci of 2. Those get reused completely from the cache. This results in an O of N time complexity because in the worst case, we only visit each node once since we store the results in the hash map. The next iteration is to solve this iteratively. We call this the bottom up or tabulation approach. In this case, we start with the initial base cases and we work ourselves up to the global solution. So in this case, we have an array that keeps tracks of the previous results and finally we land on our answer. This takes O of N time and also O of N space. The next question becomes, can we do better than O of N space? Can we do constant space? In this example, you realize that we didn't really need the entire array. We only cared about the last two numbers. So we could actually use two variables instead of an array, resulting in O of N time, but constant space. If you'd like to learn every single lead code pattern that you absolutely need to know for all your tech interviews with coding templates and lead code questions to solve, be sure to check out my blog at blog.codeinmotion.io. If you'd like to see the Blind75 list in animated format, be sure to check out my YouTube channel.